The next speaker is Ms. Mercia Roa Sonia Maloca Internacional. Please. Gracias. Thank you. I am from the Bihado people in the Amazon um, lowlands. We would like to make some suggestions about intellectual property and um, indigenous peoples. France uses its constitution from 1958 as an excuse to not recognize indigenous peoples because only the French people are recognized. This is reflected at the international level in WIPO, where the expression indigenous peoples continues to be in square brackets. That is to say, in a treaty on the protection of indigenous peoples' intellectual property, indigenous peoples are not recognized as subjects of law. A solution could be one of the ones that is, was used in the ILO Convention 69, which would be to use a uh, footnote and state that the state has room for manoeuvre at the national level for interpreting indigenous peoples as a term in accordance with its own le legal framework. There are technical problems linked to the use of databases, which could be exploited by artificial intelligence or super artificial intelligence without there being clarity about how we indigenous peoples can control that use. Then there's a question of the protection understood in Western terms for 20, 30 or 50 years, after which the intellectual property of indigenous peoples would enter the public domain. A study on intellectual property would be timely as the negotiations for a convention on combating plastic pollution could make people look towards indigenous communities practices that can offer solutions. There would be a international conference on teaching and in fact there is draft article 3 which contains a request and I quote for the decimation of cultural traditional expressions and traditional knowledge and biological genetical resources used or incorporated option B the incorporation of any request or prior record of information known to the requester that is of relevance, end of quote. The final request could be adopted without consultation of the indigenous peoples as we indigenous peoples are not represented in the negotiations. The Office of the High Commissioner could get involved in WIPO to try and ensure that Indigenous peoples are also involved. At the national level, we could coordinate with Indigenous peoples organisations and regional structures, for instance, at the level of ECLAC, so as to set some red lines that could then be set for the final products of these negotiations. Finally, we should not allow foreigners into our territories because we need to protect secrets given all that is happening and that in and of itself is problematic. So we would like to uh, draw your attention to the importance of protecting customary law of indigenous peoples as well. Thank you.